Yeah. So the other thing to check is making sure that your property ball is going to be consistently strong. So in animals that have myasthenia gravis, for example, we check to see if they have what we call a fatiguing palpebral. And so when you stimulate the palpebral, you really should have a brisk blink every single time you blink. So that's not something that should ever fatigue in an animal that has a normal reflex and a normal neuromuscular system. Um, in animals that have myasthenia gravis, one of the more unique things about their exam without palpebral is that that palpebral will get weak over time. Um, just like they will get weak over time with exercise, they'll have almost like a stimulus induced uh, fatigue of the palpebral. And so you continue to, to stimulate the palpebral like you would normally, and you will, you'll see them go from complete blink to weaker blink to not blinking at all. And their whole their eye open. So we call that a fatiguing palpebral. So it's kind of a, a cheap diagnosis for myasthenia gravis when you're waiting on a acetylcholine receptor antibody to come back. If you have that fatiguing palpebral, it's pretty supportive of myasthenia.